I was about 10 years old, I had to change schools. Well, on the way to school, we had to go through this park that was for white people only. We could walk through this park, but we couldn't stop. We just could pass through it. Well, there were swings in this park. And oh, just sometimes I really just wanted to just swing a little. But we couldn't because we were black. So we would just walk through this park and we would just walk to our school where there were no swings. Well, when we would get to school, we would line up according to our class and we would do our prayers and sing the Star Spangled Banner. And then after that, we would go on to our prospective duties for the day. I decided I wasn't going to sing the Star Spangled Banner. So every morning I just stood there and I didn't sing it. But one day a teacher noticed me and she called me over quietly and asked me why I did not sing the Star Spangled Banner. I told her because I just didn't feel like singing it. Well, she said that I would need to go to the principal and take that up with him. She said all the other school children were doing it and I had to participate as well. Okay. So I went to the principal's office and he asked me why I didn't sing the Star Spangled Banner. Finally, I said, because it says the land of the free and the home of the brave. Well, I didn't feel it was the land of the free and I didn't know who was brave, so I wasn't going to sing it. He said, well, you've been singing it all till now. Why do you want to change up? Well, then I told him about how I had to walk through that park and if I couldn't swing on those swings, and if I couldn't sit in that park, I could only walk through Shakespeare's park, then it wasn't the land of the free. Who's free? He didn't have anything to say. Then he said, well, you will pledge allegiance to your flag. Hmm. It's not my flag. That flag is about freedom. If the land is free and the flag is mine, then how come I can't do like the white kids? Power to the people, come on!